I was experimenting with this fan and found an interesting thing. The reason I had the fan was to take the humidity sensor out of it and just reverse engineer it. But watch this. I've got the fan connected to the hoppy and I'm going to plug the hoppy in and this meter is showing the voltage across the fan but I've got a capacitor here and it's not in circuit yet. So let's take a look at the fan before we add the capacitor. It's going to get noisy. Sorry, you're going to get lots of pushing noises. There's a fan. So it comes up to speed and it settles down at 89 milliamps and 14.5 watts. Okay, it's showing mains voltage across at 241 roughly. So that's 88 milliamps, say 90 milliamps, and 14 and a half watts. Watch this. I'll unplug it, making sure I don't put my fingers into it in the process. Move the capacitor. The capacitor is now in series with it, and the meter is still measuring the voltage across the fan. And I plug it in now, and all hell lets loose. Super turbo. Uh, 24 watts. From 14, it's up to 24. Uh, 120 milliamps and it's showing 305 volts across the fan. I shall unplug it because the fan will not be happy at that. So the fact that this capacitor is here in series with an inductive load, it must be the, there must be something happening that is effectively causing a phase shift that is somehow boosting the voltage and I can't quite get my head around that. Uh, if you have any thoughts on that, let me know in the comments down below.